Hello everyone and welcome to our channel. Today we are going to tell you why the F-35 costs are insane. It's over $100 million. The F-35 is a stealth multi-role combat aircraft that is designed to perform both air superiority and strike missions, as well as provide electronic warfare and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities. The F-35 is also the most expensive weapons program in history costing over $400 billion to develop and produce, and over $1.4 trillion to operate and maintain over its service life. But what makes the F-35 so expensive? And what are its features and benefits? In this video, we will explore the history, design, variants, performance, challenges, and future of the F-35 program. History The F-35 was the product of the Joint Strike Fighter GSF, program which was launched in 1993 to develop a common fighter for the U.S. Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps, as well as several allied nations. The JSF program aimed to replace various aging aircraft, such as the F-16, F-A-18, and AV-8B with a single family of stealthy, versatile, and affordable fighters. The GSF program was also a response to the development of advanced threats such as Russia's Su-57 and China's J-20 stealth fighters. The JSF program involved a competition between two teams, Lockheed Martin with its X-35 design and Boeing with its X-32 design. Both teams had to demonstrate three variants of their aircraft, a conventional takeoff and landing CTOL, variant for the Air Force, a short takeoff and vertical landing STOVL, variant for the Marine Corps, and a carrier-based CV, variant for the Navy. After a series of flight tests and evaluations, Lockheed Martin's X-35 was declared the winner in 2001 and awarded the contract to develop and produce the F-35. Design The F-35, a single-seat, single-engine stealth fighter, employs advanced materials to minimize radar detection. Its aerodynamic design enables high maneuverability, while the powerful Pratt & Whitney F-135 engine delivers up to 43,000 pounds of thrust. Equipped with a cutting-edge glass cockpit and a helmet-mounted display projecting critical data, it ensures optimal pilot control. A distributed aperture system provides complete situational awareness, with six infrared cameras, while its advanced communication system enables real-time data sharing with friendly forces. Its versatile weaponry includes an internal bay for missiles and bombs, as well as external pylons for additional armaments. Sporting a 25mm GAU-22 Slasha cannon, it can unleash up to 3,300 rounds per minute, making the F-35 a formidable force in modern aerial combat. Variants The F-35 comprises three primary variants. The F-35A, CTOL, the F-35B, STOVL and the F-35C CV. The F-35A, used by the U.S. Air Force and several partners, emphasizes agility, flying at speeds up to Mach 1.6 with a range of 450 to 600 nautical miles. The F-35B, utilized by the U.S. Marine Corps and others, offers vertical slash short takeoff and landing, reaching Mach 1.6 with a range of 450 to 500 nautical miles. The F-35C, tailored for the U.S. Navy, focuses on carrier operations, boasting larger wings for stability, flying at Mach 1.6 with a range of 600 to 700 nautical miles. Each variant accommodates diverse weapon capacities, internal and external. Performance The F-35 is designed to be a multi-role fighter that can perform both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions. The F-35 has several advantages over its predecessors and rivals, such as Stealth The F-35's stealth features make it hard to detect and track by enemy radars and sensors, giving it a significant edge in combat situations. Sensor Fusion The F-35's sensor fusion capability allows it to collect, process, and share data from multiple sources, giving it a comprehensive picture of the battlefield and enhancing its situational awareness and decision-making. Network-Centric Warfare The F-35's network-centric warfare capability allows it to communicate and cooperate with other friendly forces, such as other aircraft, ships, satellites, and ground troops, creating a seamless and integrated force multiplier effect. Interoperability 
The F-35's interoperability capability allows it to operate with a wide range of allies and partners, enhancing its flexibility and effectiveness in coalition operations. The F-35 has also demonstrated its combat potential in several exercises and operations, such as Red Flag The F-35 participated in several Red Flag exercises, which are realistic air combat training scenarios involving multiple forces and threats. The F-35 achieved impressive results, such as a 20 to 1 kill ratio against simulated enemy fighters and a 100% mission success rate against simulated ground targets. Operation Inherent Resolve the F-35 conducted its first combat mission in 2018, when it struck an Islamic State tunnel network in Iraq. The F-35 also conducted several other missions in support of the U.S.-led coalition against the Islamic State in Iraq and Syria. Operation Eager Lion The F-35 participated in Operation Eager Lion in 2019, which was a joint exercise between the U.S. and Jordanian forces. The F-35 demonstrated its ability to conduct close air support air interdiction, suppression of enemy air defenses, and dynamic targeting missions. Challenges Despite its impressive capabilities and performance, the F-35 also faces several challenges and criticisms, such as Cost The F-35's cost is one of the main sources of controversy and debate. The F-35's acquisition cost is estimated at $400 billion, making it the most expensive weapons program ever. The F-35's operating cost is estimated at $1.45 trillion over its service life, making it one of the most expensive aircraft to fly and maintain. The F-35's cost has been criticized for being too high and unsustainable for the U.S. and its allies. Delays The F-35's development and production have been plagued by delays and setbacks. The F-35 was originally scheduled to enter service in 2012, but it was delayed until 2015 for the Marine Corps, 2016 for the Air Force, and 2019 for the Navy. The delays were caused by various technical issues, design changes, testing failures, software glitches, and quality problems. Reliability The F-35's reliability is another source of concern and scrutiny. The F-35's reliability is measured by its availability rate, which is the percentage of time that an aircraft is ready for flight. The F-35's availability rate is currently around 60%, which is below the target of 80%. The low availability rate means that the F-35 is often grounded or undergoing maintenance, reducing its operational effectiveness. Vulnerabilities The F-35's vulnerabilities are another source of doubt and skepticism. The F-35's vulnerabilities include its dependence on stealth, which could be compromised by advanced detection systems or countermeasures its dependence on software, which could be hacked or corrupted by cyber attacks, its dependence on logistics, which could be disrupted or denied by enemy actions, and its dependence on allies, which could be unreliable or uncooperative. Future The F-35's future is uncertain and depends on several factors, such as demand linked to strategic needs and budgets of the US and allies, affected by evolving security environments and combat effectiveness. Competition, determined by rival offerings like Russia's Su-57, China's J-20, or Europe's future combat air system, along with potential upgrades to existing fighter fleets. Innovation, driven by adaptability and performance enhancements through software updates, advanced weaponry, and technology integration, possibly including artificial intelligence, unmanned teaming, and hypersonic capabilities. Adaptation to these factors will be crucial in determining the F-35's long-term success. Conclusion The F-35, an innovative multirole stealth fighter, encounters challenges and criticism despite its versatility. Its future hinges on factors like demand, competition, and innovation, making it a compelling and debated subject. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did then please like and subscribe to our channel and hit bell icon to stay update in further videos. Thanks for tuning in.